y'all favorite Texan here, old Pat. Little Rooks behind me, welcome back. Yes, that is a real rooster if it's your first time here at the channel. Appreciate you being here this time. We have a very special review, man. What can I say about this icon? It's an understatement to say he's underrated. I'm not a rapper. Come on, man. This man has such an impact in the center defensive mid role. It's none other than the Real Madrid, the Chelsea legend, prime 90 rated Claude McAuley. Now, this is a special one, man. I remember growing up watching this dude. And, you know, again, that role wasn't really defined in his time when he was playing for Real Madrid. But he was dominant in his position, wasn't he? Fearless, tenacious, incredible tackler. Fantastic player. And y'all know what happened. When, when he left Real Madrid, they brought in David Beckham. They missed McAuley for a really long time. McAuley went to Chelsea, and y'all know what he did there. The success. Not just him, but the other additions. Bringing that success back to Stanford Bridge. It, it's, it's amazing to be able to watch that in real time. I just remember watching that. and I always liked him, you know, trying to understand the role, but just knowing that, man, this dude is, is dominant. You know, was it wasn't, he was just, I had that dog in him, man. When he go in for a tackle, he didn't care. Like he, he wanted to win that ball. Oh, incredible player. Anyway, so it's called McAuley, man. We have to read this. He's a special icon. In 2000, Claude McAuley moved from Gallican Club, Celta Vigo to Spanish Giants, Real Madrid, perhaps underappreciated at times. There's no perhaps. McAuley's performances in front of the back four were lauded by his teammates as the club won an impressive array of trophies during his three seasons in Madrid. He helped Real win La Liga in 2000-01 and 2002-03, although the UEFA Champions League win in 2001-2002 through 2002 was arguably the highlight of an extremely successful spell in McAuley's career, man. So as we're talking about McAuley, we have to look at the card. He's 5'9", obviously low attacking work rates, High defensive work rates, which you love to see for a defensive man. Right footer, three star combo right on. As we look further in, we're seeing a guy that looks fantastic, man. On paper, 85 jumping, 92 is stamina. You gotta have high stamina. In central midfield, you know, in general, you know, defensive mid, you're you're he has a big job to do. He's literally, he's that, he's that line, that wall before they meet the center backs. He, he's got a lot of job to do, big job to do, and big shoes to fill. So he's got to have high stamina, 86 strength plus 89 aggression. Y'all know on this game, doesn't matter if you're an attacker or a defender. Aggression is key. Combined with strength makes you even better. And like I said, man, he was an incredible tackler in real life. 92 interceptions, fantastic. 89 defensive awareness, 94 stand tackle, 85 slide tackle. Dribbling, y'all, look at this. 85 agility, 90 balance. So you know he's gonna feel crazy on the ball. Huge, huge plus. 89 reaction, 85 ball control. Fantastic for a defensive man. 88 composure, incredible, man. As the passing, y'all know the two, the two stats I care about the most. Short pass, primarily, and long pass. Short pass 91, long pass 84. You know, pair that with the 83 vision and 80 pace overall, man. Incredible, incredible card. As far as camp styles, 
you can go a lot of routes, uh, you know, with this card. Whether you want to put a shadow on them, bump the pace up, whatever. This card came with a Sentinel. That's what we're going to use them with. Try them out with that. Super excited, man. Love this guy in real life. I've been wanting to use this card on FIFA 19. I, I just I just didn't. But, you know, he's going to be playing alongside the, the giant Mr. Vieira here. So, you know, we see, you know, we're playing him in this squad right here. Nothing too crazy. We're really going to see how he does. And uh, let's get into it right, y'all. Get into it right now, y'all. We're going to be swapping them in between this formation. Uh, I'm, um, I might rock him on bounce a little, little bit, but uh, he'll pro probably primarily be on stay back while attacking. Going to be playing him in a 4 triple 2 as well. And probably a little bit of 4-2-3-1, y'all. So let's get into it, man. Also, man, I want to give a big salute, man. Two big salutes. First of all, man, I'm going to give a big salute to Lil Bro. Viper, Ninja Boys, big salute to you, man. I know it was your birthday. You said it was your birthday uh, the other day. Happy belated birthday, man. Um, sorry more people didn't say it to you, but happy belated birthday from Texas, man, from your favorite Texan. So happy belated, brother. Have a blessed 2020. Also, can I give a big salute to my guy, Mr. Johnny from the UK? <laughs> bruv, bruv. <laughs> hey, I switched the squad name, man. Just, just for you, just for you, Johnny. It's a game, bro. Chill. <laughs> Big salute to Mr. Johnny, man, and to the old Chinese, man. If you know, you know. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let's get into this review. Yo, he feels so good on the ball, man, with that, that high agility and balance. I love his positioning, too. Playing real deep right now. That's good, that's good with me. Oh, great ball, Makaleli. Oh, Makaleli making the run. Don't mind it. Look at that, man. Just making himself open. I love that. Nice, Makalele. Just getting in the way, just disrupting. Can we switch that? Great pass. Great, great. Just the ability to be able to turn quick there and get the ball out. It's definitely a token to his composure and like his high agility and balance, man. It feels really nice. Yeah, bang it around. Oh, 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 great ball. Great, great ball, Makalele, man. Look at that, man. That's like stuff he did in real life, just the ability to turn that quickly. Bro, that's like some Real Madrid type stuff he was doing, man. That was great job to win the ball there. Just, just looking, looking. Can we find somebody? Virgil coming to help. Yeah. Oh, great ball. Yeah! Oof. Yeah, I was trying to find Vardy right there. I, think he could, I feel like he could have made that pass, like if it would have got through. Nice, that's that type of stuff I like. That was a good ball, just a bad touch by Vardy. Applying pressure. Great ball. Yeah, it's that calmness, Makalele. Beautiful. Yes, sir. Nice. Great ball. Real subtle, but look at him continuing the run. Oh, 
What a ball. Beautiful Makalele. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Lele. <laughs> Referee. I was off. Oh, no, no, ref, ref. That ball's to Makalele, sir. Great work by there. Great work there by Makalele, man. Oh, well done, Makalele. Just doing enough just to disrupt it. He had a lot to do right there. I love that, man. Just put him off balance. Look at that. I'm still helping out. Patrick Vieira. Nice swish, Mac. Oh, Makalele! <laughs> Fight, keep fighting, Mac. Come on, man. Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, Makalele. What a ball. <laughs> Great run, Mac. Getting involved, man. Great ball to Dirty Harry. Great goal. Oof, give me that. We need all that. We need all of it. Dude is strong, man. He is so strong. No, sir. <laughs> oh, dirty. <laughs> but that, we only got that opportunity because of what Makalele did. He gone. <laughs> Y'all, this card is fantastic, man. I'm very, I'm very pleased to say I'm very thoroughly impressed by this Claude McAlilly. Prime version, 90 rated overall. Y'all, just to get it out the way, um, I feel like the Sentinel camp style works really well. You know, obviously pushing the aggression strength you know, stand, tackle, slide and tackle, all that stuff to 99 overall. And you can really feel the game. It feels awesome. Agility and balance, you do not need to bump that up. He turns on a dime. He turns like a like a high-end cam, you know. Uh, he really does. He turns fantastic. And, you know, you combine that with high composure like he has, you really feel comfortable with what he does. Honestly, I'm going to give him straight up, I'm going to give him a 10 out of 10. Because for me, I feel like for what I need him for out of a CDM, he has everything in his locker in that role. Honestly, man, the 80 pace overall felt plenty for me. He's active, man. He's 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 little, but he's dominant. He's feisty like Conte. This is like Conte's old man right here, honestly. I've used multiple Conte cards. I've used... Gold Conte, I've used the uh, Team of the Year nominee Conte. Man, this guy right here, he's he's above Conte for me. It really is. And I love Conte. Conte's a heck of a card. But I feel like this guy's above him in that way. And, and <clears throat> combining him with another Premier League legend. And also a friend of his, his fellow countrymen, Frenchman. Patrick Vieira, they were incredible, man. I, honestly, I, I didn't feel like them two combined. I didn't feel like I was lacking anything in defensive mid. Uh, incredible card, y'all. Great passing. You do wonderful link of play. Honestly, if you want him to go forward a little bit uh, to get involved, he can do that as well with his composure, with his passing. He can make some really nice, nice passes as well. Fantastic card, y'all. I can't, I can't list a con on this card. For, Cause for for defensive man, there's nothing more that I that I I'd want for him. You combine him being shorter with a taller uh, CDM, playing him in a two CDM formation, like a Vieira, like a Footman Sissoko. I know a Footman Sissoko, he would be great as well. Uh, somebody a taller man, that that yin and yang with the the taller. Uh, CDM and the shorter CDM, whether it's Conte Vieira, Conte Sissoko, 
whatever the, the short and the tall <laughs> it's fantastic in FIFA 20 man very impressed thoroughly impressed with this card back of Lele Lele humbled honor to use this card and honestly for his price 800 some odd K I think he's a fantastic pickup I feel like he's in game I feel like you know, Conte and Essien, I'm not saying this guy's as strong as Essien, but I'm saying Nicolele has a little bit more finesse. Y'all know he played for Real Madrid. He would make tackles you weren't expecting him to make. Feisty, man. He's He's got the finesse, too. I feel like Conte and Essien, fantastic CDMs. I feel like he more seasoned. You know, he did it before they did. Finesse. They definitely added some finesse to this card. Hope y'all enjoy this review, man. It's your favorite Texan hero, Pat. Appreciate y'all, man. Little roots behind me. Appreciate all the support. It means the world to the both of us. More reviews coming real soon. Talk to y'all real soon. Big salutes, y'all. God bless.